And welcome back to Inside the Valley on this Sunday morning. Well, right now we're talking to folks from the NAACP about this fantastic banquet that they have coming up. It's the 47th annual, so if you have missed the previous 46, you definitely want to make sure you attend the 47th. Talk a little bit more about it on the show. We have Terry Mills. Hey, Terry, great Good seeing morning. you. Good morning. Good to see you again. Yeah, great to see you again. Happy New Year. It's Happy been a long time, too. right? Absolutely, absolutely. Now, uh, this banquet that you have coming up here, uh, not only is it going to be a fantastic opportunity for folks to get out there and kind of get involved and see what it's all about, but you're also honoring former mayor, uh, Richard Cortez. Richard Cortez, the former mayor of McAllen, Texas. He had done things for the NAACP back in the day. Mm -hmm. We went to him and we thanked him, thanked the city council, but we want to take it to a granular level. Yeah. We're having our annual banquet, but it's going to be in Corpus Christi, Texas. Okay. I don't want to get confused and go to another location, yeah. but it's in Corpus Christi, and, yeah. and we're so excited about it because you know what? Mayor Cortez, when we had our state convention here a few years ago, mm -hmm. he welcomed the NAACP on the state and national level. Wow. And you have members coming from as far as Midland and West Texas, Odessa, Houston, San Antonio, all the way down to McAllen. And mm -hmm. it was just a grand old time. Mayor Cortez, City Council, everybody welcome us. And, you know, we want to say thank you again. Yeah. But in a grandier way. Absolutely. Oh, great. You got the singing voice on this one. It's fantastic. So for folks who um, don't really know what it is that the NAACP does, can you kind of just fill us in real quickly? Or? And I'm so glad you asked that question. NAACP was started by white Jewish people for everybody. Mm -hmm. Back in the early 1900s, there was a lot of burning of houses and raping and killing and whatever. So you had a group of white people came together and wanted to form an organization to help everybody. Mm -hmm. National, Associ National Association of Basketball of Color People. I'm a color, you're a color, he's a color, and we're all colors. And people think it's for black people or African Americans. It's for everybody. Right. And so it's a civil organization. If you've been discriminated against what is housing and your sexual rotation, your religion, and this goes on and on and on, we get involved. If there's meat on the bone, we're going to take it. Absolutely. <laughs> it's fantastic, too. And I like that you say, you know, because uh, I think a lot of people have that perception that the NAACP is just for African Americans. Oh, God, no. Which it isn't, because mm -hmm. I have, you know, met a lot of pe other people who are a part of the NAACP and who are, you know, Caucasian or Hispanic. And, you know, some people don't understand that. Now, w how can someone get involved and, and be a part of the NAACP and kind of help out? Well, you can go to the website, mm -hmm. uh, go to the website, Corpus Christi NAACP.org. Download, download the application or go online and fill it out and become a member. Mm -hmm. And back in the day, we had a chapter down here. We're getting ready to get it started up again pretty soon. Mm -hmm. But I, my territory is from Corpus Christi all the way up here to Laredo, back and forth. And we're going to get the chapter restarted here. And so if you want to be part of this chapter or any other chapter, just join the association. We've been yeah. around since 1909. Yeah, and you know, as you say earlier, if there's a little bit of beat, meat on the bone, yeah, you're going to take it Yeah, meat on the sure. bone. And you're, and you're helping a lot of folks here in the Valley too, right? Oh, absolutely. I mean, we come back and forth all the time here. Yeah. I mean, I slip in and slip out, and yeah. I slip in to, to tell you guys about the banquet and stuff. Yeah. And also, before I forget, mm -hmm. The other recipient, her name is Gabby Canales. She's an attorney in Corpus Christi. Okay. Her brother's a state rep, Tara Canales, out of Edinburgh. Right. And so we just want to say thank you because if we don't go back and say thank you to those who have made a difference, we're cheating. Right. Or yeah. we're stealing, I should say. Mm -hmm. We don't ever want to be, called, be accused of stealing. We always want to say thank you. Absolutely. And I want to thank this TV station for allowing me again to come back. We have NWCP and KRGV, John Kitterman, his staff. We have a long list of history together and I'm just appreciative because it's about community projects, giving back to the community, making it better for the generations coming behind us. Yeah, absolutely. And this banquet obviously is a big success because it's the 47th annual. Um, and this is a great opportunity for folks. Uh, you should go and, and be a part of this because it's going to be fantastic. You've got some great keynote speakers as well. The mayor of San Antonio, Mayor Ivy Taylor from San Antonio, yes. Texas. Yeah. She is fantastic. Yeah, she's got a lot of uh, contagious energy, uh, a mm. fantastic speaker as well. Yes. Yeah. And, and when we asked her, she just said yes. Yeah. I mean, she has other things that she could be doing with her family, her staff, or for San Antonio, but she's going to give her some of her time, and we're appreciative. And we're going to have a grand old time. We're going to have a good meal. Oh, yeah. Good speaker. Good entertainment. We're going to start on time. We're going to leave on time. Okay, so now we're talking about time. <laughs> when is it? We know it's in Corpus Christi. Uh, what a, time? It's going to be at American Bank Center. Okay. From 930 to 1030. Excuse me, from 730 to 930 at American Bank Center. Go to Ticketmaster.com. 
get your ticket and be done with it. How much? How much are the tickets? The tickets are sixty-seven dollars. Just sixty-seven dollars. That's it. Just sixty-seven dollars. Yes. We're not having chicken and we're not having fish. <laughs> we're gonna have a awesome <laughs> meal. Can you tell us a little bit about the meal? I cannot tell you because if I tell you, you might yeah. not want to show. But you know what? It's good. Yeah. It is good meal. Were you the good professional fish. taste tester for it? <laughs> like you know what? We're not gonna do the fish. We're not gonna do the chicken. Absolutely. We're gonna do this. Well, I mean, you know, when you pay a, a lot of money for a ticket, yeah, I wanna. I, Personally, I want a good meal. Yeah. It's going to be an awesome meal. Yeah. And I, not only the meal, the whole event, the whole, oh yeah. uh, just the, the atmosphere of just being there and being a part of something that is amazing, that's, that's doing a lot of great things in the Valley and all the way up Corpus Christi and Laredo, your sector. Uh, it's just great to be part of something that is, is giving back and, oh, and great for the, the good of humanity. And you said it, giving back. Yeah. If we don't give back, why are we here? Mm -hmm. If we don't give back to make your life, his life, their life easier, why are we here? Mm -hmm. Why are we here? We've taken up good oxygen and needless space. Yeah. But when we give back, we're making it better for someone else coming behind us. Right. And again, you're going to be doing a great thing. As you say, you like to give thanks. So you're going to be honoring former Mayor Richard Cortez. Now, awesome person. Hopefully he knows about this and he's not just oh, finding out oh right now, Oh, my God. Right? Please don't tell him, you guys. Oh, no. <laughs> we ruined the surprise. We're sorry. <laughs> you might get an invite in the mail here within the next couple of days. Yes, or so. he knows. Yeah, he knows. When I called him a few weeks ago, we talked about it. And I told him, I says, Mayor Cortez, this is Terry. Yeah. Terry Mills, do you remember me? Sure, I remember you. And he and I, we had dialogue. We talked about maybe 15, 20 minutes. What did he say when you, when you said, hey, you know, we want to honor you? He was very humble. Sure, yeah. He was very humble. And I told him, I said, remember back when we had the state convention here? I said, Mary Gutierrez, you did a lot for us. You did a lot for us that you didn't have to. The, uh, uh, the convention center did a lot for us. And I mean, it was just overwhelming. Yeah. And because of what he did, the city of McAllen did, we want to say thank you again. And he's, he's just a humble guy. Absolutely. He's just a humble guy. I mean, he's good people. Yeah. And you he's need that. People. You need that nowadays. And you need leadership like that, too. That's and, exactly right. And uh, helping out. Uh, folks, if you're just tuning in right now, we're talking about the uh, 47th annual NAACP banquet that's coming up here, uh, honoring former mayor Richard uh, Cortez. Uh, real quickly here, Terry, uh, let folks that know, know uh, where it is, when it is, uh, the hours, and, of course, ticket prices. The who, the what, when, the where. You said it better than In I Corpus did. Corpus Christi, Texas. Yeah. Saturday, January the 14th, American Bank Center from 7.30 to 9.30. Tickets are $67. Go to Ticketmaster.com and you can get your ticket, download it, come enjoy. There's going to be so many people there. I, I can... There, I just want to give all the secrets out. Yeah. If you don't, if you want to figure out what the secret is, come to Corpus Christi. It's just two hours away. Yeah. Stay at the way. Omni Hotel. Yeah. That'll put you up for a nice fee. Yeah. <laughs> a nice fee, absolutely. <laughs> and uh, real quickly here, Terry, where can folks get a little bit more information as well? They can go to the website. Mm -hmm. They can call us uh, NACP, NACP at sprint.blackberry.net or 361-548-9489. 361-548-9489. Perfect. Or oh, they can call you. Okay. You got the info right there. Yeah, I got the info right there. We've also posted it, folks, for you on the screen there. 361-548-9489. Uh, We've also posted a little bit more information. Terry, it's always great seeing you. Happy New Year. Thank you. It's always a pleasure to see you. And thank you for having me again. Absolutely. No worries at all. And, folks, don't go anywhere on this Sunday morning. When we come back, we're talking about a great event called End Polio Night with the Vipers. We'll talk a little bit more about polio, and we'll talk about how you can get involved and help out. Don't go anywhere.